Hello, good morning or good day. Welcome to Turning Point with Femi Emmanuel. Welcome also to Sunday, the 29th day in January 2023. Another name for Sunday is the Lord's Day. On this Lord's Day, may God single you out for special blessings. Raise your 2023 expectation list, the key and the currency note. We are redeemed to be wonders on earth. Isaiah chapter 8 verse 18 says, Behold, I and the children whom the Lord has given me, we are for signs and wonders in Israel. Let's say that to yourself. Whether you have biological children now or not, say, I, then mention your name, as I also mention my name here. Say, I, Femi Emmanuel, and mention your own name. And the children whom the Lord has given me, we are for signs and wonders in Nigeria and the whole world. Mention your own country and the whole world. Yes, you are, and you shall be. I prophesy to someone's life today, you shall become the source of supply to your detractors and those who initially thought you will never become anything. This currency note, the key, and the 2023 expectation list, they shall manifest wonders in your life. I want to pray for people with health challenges today. I have a nudge in my heart to pray for them. As I mention your own concern, please believe God for your healing. Someone is suffering from diabetes mellitus. Your healing from diabetes is today. Who is this? You hear a ringing sensation in your hair or on your head. It will be ringing like something is ringing. Then everyone with air problems, you shall be healed today. Put your finger there. Toothache, very painful toothache. Then mouth ulcer and mouth odor. Every problem in the mouth. After this prayer, gargle with the water I breathe for you and then throw it out. And you, you went through a surgery sometimes ago, the side effect is still there, so much pains despite medication, and anyone still having aches and pains despite medications on any ailment, God is healing you today. You are taking medita medication, but the problem persists. The great physician is healing you now. Get ready, because that is what is going to be for you today. Then who is this? With mast, abdominal mast, or mast in any part of your body at all. The place is hard. You press it, you feel the hardness. Whether painful or not, it's a mast. Touch the place for prayer. It will disappear after this prayer. Have faith. Then severe pain, uh, spine pain, spine pain, arthritis, and joint pains. They say it is bone degeneration. God will heal your bones and your joints now. Bleeding. A woman is bleeding excessively. It must stop, no matter the cause of it. Then finally, this sickness has taken you to many places. Different hospitals, different doctors, harbor homes, prayer houses. Yet, you are still suffering from it. All cases mentioned. Lay your hand on your mantle. The Bible says, by his stripes, ye were healed. Jesus has suffered for you. Therefore, I command all afflictions on you or anyone listening to me now to drop. Aches and pains, discomforts, go. Go. Must melt, bleeding, stop. What Jesus has suffered for you, you will not suffer it again. I declare all concern healed in Jesus' name. All say, I'm healed. Say it again. Say it again. Now, check it out. You are healed. Try doing what you couldn't do before. Check, press, walk up and down, bend down and rise up again. It's gone. Send your testimonies when you see these changes taking place. January 29th, celebrant. Your prayers be blessed, be divinely covered. You will fulfill your days. You will prosper and do well in Jesus' name. Now to testimonies. Connect to these testimonies by faith, also by sacrificial seed, if you can. First testimony today, I thank God Almighty for giving me victory concerning a court case that lasted for almost four years. Number two, for his provision for me and my loved ones. Three, God enlarged my business and also connected me to many destiny helpers. Four, for granting me journey mercies to and fro during Christmas. He will do more. Another testifier. Praise God. I thank God for saving my husband's life. Papa said that we will see death, but we will not die. My husband saw death, but God saved him. Wow. 
none of us will die prematurely. Somebody said, I want to thank God for his mercy, provision and faith, faithfulness over my life and family. When Papa always say, we should touch where we need healing. I always touch my knees and my eyes. I just realized that my knees pains are gone. And before I could say, I am now seeing clearly, even without using glasses. May God's name be praised. Every one of you, healing is coming over your life. Another one, our great God has done it again. My daughter got admission at the university of her choice and with her choice course, it could only be God. Thank you, Jesus, for whom you are in my life and family. He will do more for you. Good morning, Daddy. I want to bless the name of the Lord concerning my last semester exam. I had seven A's and out of 11, wow, you will be more brilliant. Somebody said, I thank God for safe delivery on the 24th of January this year. My new year and post birthday gift has arrived. Pastor, please pray that God wipes away every trace of jaundice from my baby. Please, Daddy, give my baby a name, sir. Wow, God will wipe away every trace of jaundice. Let me know the uh, sex of my grandchild, whether male or female, so I can give the appropriate name. Send that back. Somebody said, I want to bless the name of the Lord for all his doings, for answering my memo one after the other. My iron in the shop stopped working since last week, Wednesday. On Tuesday this week, I decided to anoint it, cover it with mantu for three days. I prayed on it on Thursday. When I came back from Prayer Mountain, getting to shop on Friday, I plugged it and it started working well. Wow! Anointing, healing, all kinds of things. Somebody said, I want to thank God Almighty for giving my little sister UK visa. May his name be forever praised. And I pray that your anointing we not run dry, sir. Amen. Another testifier. I sent a message that my EDD is this January, and you prayed for me that God will grant me according to my heart desire to the glory of God. While I was in labor, I took the blessed water, and after some hours, in the midnight, around 3.45 a.m., on the 10th of this month, I put to bed. Thanks be to God Almighty, and thank you, our daddy, for allowing God to use you for us. My first testimony in turning point. Oh, you will have more testimony. God will keep you and the baby. Another person. Good morning, turning point global family. I'm testifying of the goodness of God for divine healing, for health, provision, and protection throughout 2022 on my family. Now God did a miracle. One of the names wrapped in my anointed man to bless my family with a gift of 200,000 naira this January 2023. This is marvelous in my sight. Thank you, O oh Lord, our God, for your goodness and wonderful works. God is going to do more and more for you this year. Somebody said, I want to thank God Almighty for this platform and for the grace of God on our daddy, Femi Emmanuel. Our car was bad and we packed it at home. I decided to place my mantle on it and prayed. After some time, God blessed my family with a lovely luxury car. I also want to thank God for a lot upon a lot. Just this afternoon, God used my brother to credit my account with good money. And my tithe has been sent to the GT account of the commission. Praise the Lord. Many more people will send you good money. Be sending the tithe to the GT account of the commission and all the other accounts. Somebody said my testimonies. One, I want to thank God specially for adding another year to my life and taking care of my family. Two, the Lord changed my financial status after that he asked us to pray for less labor and more profit. Three, I want to thank God for healing me and saving me from the hand of the evil ones. Four, God made it possible for my visa to be renewed after wrapping my passport with the mantu and praying over it. Lastly, I thank God for making me a member of this platform. Daddy, God will continue to bless your ministry and give you the strength to continue teaching us. Thanksgiving seed coming soon. And I pray God continue to answer my prayers this year. He will answer all your prayers this year. Another person, join me to celebrate Tony Point family. I published my first book titled A Purposeful Life on December 12, 2022. Thank you, Daddy, for teaching us to be our best. All of you will be your best. Please broadcast this to all on your contact. Do so daily. Join us this morning 
in our two Sunday services online, 7 to 9 a.m. first service, 9 to 11 a.m. second service. Watch it live or watch it later, but don't miss the Sunday services. Have you subscribed to our new YouTube platform? I kept asking you to subscribe. Many have not. Why now? Do so today. Open your YouTube and type a YouTube at the realfemiemmanuel.com. Real Femi Emmanuel, R E A L. YouTube at the real Fabian Emmanuel .com. Please do so, then turn on notification. So each time we send a post on we are on, you can know. Month is ending. If you are a monthly title, battle, thanksgiving, partnership commitment, and the 111 seed we are sowing this month. Do so today or as soon as you can. In February, our seed shall move on to two, 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 two as many twos we can add. That will be double, 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 double. I prophesy to everyone's life today, you will do well. You will do good. God hasn't led you this far to abandon you. You will not be abandoned. Somebody there, you're feeling one kind. You really cannot tell what's happening. There will be a divine turnaround. What you lack now will soon be surplus. God will keep you moving on. You will be shining. Helpers will be coming. Grace will be multiplying. Where you look before and you didn't see anything, when you look at it again, you will see what you desire. Oh, I prophesy, God will take vengeance over all the forces of enemy against you. Those are powers that want to shut you down and hold you down, terminate your life and cut you short. God will visit them with judgment of fire. You are released. This is your year. You will not be down. You will not be shut down. You will not die. You will excel in all you do. What God cannot do does not exist. God sent me because of you. Heaven will not rest until you are truly blessed and fulfilled. I'm Femi Emmanuel. I love you. Have a wonderful day and have a prosperous year. Amen.